something that I am avid about now that I had no clue about when I was little is nutrition. It changes your, your, your body, it changes your clarity of thought, it changes your way of thinking, it changes your way of living. Um, it, it just creates a, a total balance of your body and your mind and kind of brings them together and work, work together. I didn't find out about nutrition until I was, I guess, going into the draft, going into the draft. I really didn't, I didn't know about it. About in college. I ate terrible in college. I, I just didn't take care of my body. I ate late at night. Um, and and uh, as, I, as, I, as I grew and understood about nutrition, as a professional athlete, that your body is your business. So you have to take care of it just like you would a, you know, a building that you run or anything like that. So you know, I, I cut out a lot, of, a lot of red meat. I eat chicken and fish, um, water, a lot of water. Um, stay away from sweets, candy, cakes, pies, all of that stuff. Um, you know, it just, it tones your muscles, it cuts out the fat, you have more energy, you feel more alive inside, you really do. Because it's kind of corny as a kid to eat broccoli and, and things like that. You know, it's really, it is, it's corny. You know, I didn't do it. You know, I ate pizza and burgers. I could, I could get away with it because my metabolism was so fast, but I think today's kid is different than, than, than my kid. My kids were when I grew up was because, you know, you have video games, you have things like that that keep kids on the couch. So I don't think they're getting as much exercise as, as I, I was when I was a kid, you know. We didn't have, I mean, we had a Nintendo and Super Nintendo, but it wasn't as cool as, like, I couldn't get online and play somebody from Japan. Like, it just couldn't happen. So I think the kids nowadays are, are finding themselves more and more indoors. I mean, that's, that's just the way technology is. That's, that's the way our society is moving, so I don't knock it. But what I, what I think is we have to have some way to uh, kind of compensate for the change, and I think that's nutrition. If I was, you know, health conscious about nutrition when I was little, I think I could have been, you know, five times the athlete I am today. It, it, it's, it's that much of a difference. Uh, people, people kind of take it for granted, you know, that, that that what you eat. But like, what you eat is, you, you know, your body's your temple. It, your food is your fuel. So if you keep feeding the garbage, you're gonna get garbage. A lot of the diseases nowadays, you know, heart disease, um, you know, they're they're starting to leak cancer to to some of the stuff that people intake and, and what you're eating. Um, and throughout the course of a lifetime, if you if you keep eating garbage, you know, your body's gonna tell you this is wrong. I mean, that's just the way the body works.